I think we should show everybody how good I am at the game, and so we should really? play. Really? Okay. <laughs> yeah, we can do that. <laughs> yeah, so why don't we, you know, this is the first look at gameplay ever uh, for Gears Yeah, Pop, let's so. actually show the game. Yeah, let's do it. All right, here we are in the Gears Pop Arena. The object of the game is to play out your units and push forward and take down the outposts and the leader at the opposite end of the field. I generally start with this Lancer gear. It'll move forward and start to take cover. This being a Gears game, cover's very important. You'll notice that the blue bar underneath the gear's feet will start to fill up. If it can completely fill that bar, then boom, I get that piece of cover. Other units, like this Marcus Phoenix, will move forward and he'll take cover much faster. That's sort of his special trick. And you'll notice that my territory has now expanded, so I can spawn my pins further forward, like those wretches that are now running up on my opponent's outpost. I'm going to try to press this advantage by playing units on both the left and the right to try to take a little bit more territory, but Rod's put that boomer right in the middle, so I'm going to use a Hammer of Dawn. Now this is my ultimate ability and will charge up over time, so now I'm going to have to wait a while before I use that again. That Nasher drone is sunk in, so I'm going to use a frag grenade and take care of that problem. Meanwhile, my outposts will clear the wretches. Now my deck is primarily comprised of units with special abilities. Uh, this JD has a down but not out ability, uh, and my Marcus, as I said, takes cover quickly. Now I'm going to put down my Kate. Now Kate's special because she has sort of a bonsai ability. She's going to run forward and ignore the enemy units and just start hammering those outposts. It looks like she's doing plenty of damage, which is great, because if I can take that outpost down, I'll be ahead in the game by one point. Looking really good. Let's see if I can get it. Okay, excellent. There's a grinder on the left. I think I have enough power to put out some additional targets, but he did manage to take down my outpost. I reacted a little bit late to that, so I gotta keep throwing things at that grinder. We're about a minute left, so it's double power, which means that power bar at the bottom is gonna increase even faster and allow me to play units a lot more quickly. It's a tied game right now. He's taken one of my outposts and I've taken one of his. So really, I'm just gonna try to push the advantage on one side or the other. Okay, so he's played a couple big, tough, expensive locust units. So I think he's kind of playing a deck that's really about pushing those monsters forward. My deck's really about taking territory and the tricks of the different units. So uh, I think I've got a pretty good matchup here. I know what to do. He's putting out a lot of units and I just lost my territory on the right side. Uh, my strategy is going out the window. My deck really is about pushing that control of the territory, so I might be in trouble here. Now we've got double power. This is good for him because he can drop big units more quickly, but I can exploit that too by dropping multiple units faster than he can. It looks like we're gonna run out of regulation time with a score of one to one. And when that happens, we enter sudden death, which means that the next person to score an outpost will win the game. I am throwing out everything I can, but that grinder is going to take me down. Oh, I think he got me. Yeah, that's the end. Looks like Rod does know a thing or two about Gears of War. Uh, and so there we go. As you can see, I clearly dominated the battlefield. Yes, you totally, totally won that game. <laughs> you wouldn't throw a game with you. I would. <laughs> All right, so it, I'm having fun, I'm excited. Uh, I love what I'm seeing, I wanna play, like when can I? Yeah, so we're still in soft launch, we're perfecting the game, uh, but in 2019 it'll be available for everyone and it'll be great. All right, can't wait, I hope I see you there. Yeah.